Hello guys, the DB Grinder here, back at it again with another video, and this time we have Pals Before Gals with 923 rating versus Jeremy Taibu with 1,654 rating, so it's going to be another high rated DB video. Also, before we hop in, make sure to go ahead and check out Sleeve Chief, you can also use my code for 5% off. They got some new uh, Super Saiyan sleeves, they also got like a Super Saiyan deck box, and they have more new stuff on the website. Also, they did a huge restock, so make sure to go ahead and check them out. And okay, hopping right into the match now. We see Jeremy win the Rock, Paper, Scissors shoot. They'll decide to go first. 40 versus 43. Opening hands, we got Imperm, Abyss Actor, Wild Hope, Abyss Actor, Cosmic Relief, Abyss Actor, Extras, Abyss Actor, Dress Rehearsal. They have Droll, Unicorn Desires, Imperm, Pressured Planet. All right, looks like I'm reading. Uh, okay, so uh, once per turn, you target one other Abyss Actor card in your Pendulum Zone. Its scale becomes 9 until the end of the turn, and then you're locked into Abyss Actors. Okay, for the rest of the turn. Okay. Um, then it says monster effect. You can make this card gain 100 attack for each abyss monster you currently control. Cancel the end of the turn. If this card is destroyed by battle or card effect, you can add an abyss actor card from the deck to the hand. Sweet. Then we get cosmic relief. You can target one abyss actor pendulum monster you control and one monster the opponent controls. Switch control of them, then destroy this card. Monster effect. You take no battle damage from attacks involving this card once per turn during your standby phase. Give control of this card to the opponent. Once per turn, if you control this face up card, activate this effect. The owner of this destroys one set abyss actor spell. Okay. Okay. Once per turn, if you control this. Okay, if it changes. Alright. Then they have abyss actor extras. This one says if your opponent controls a monster, special summon this card from the pendulum zone. You contribute this card to summon an abyss actor monster, pendulum monster from your deck, and then you are locked into abyss actors for the rest of the turns. Uh, you can act, you can nor activate the effect of abyss. Okay, so you can't summon this out from the scale after you use that effect. Dress rehearsal at the start of main phase. Add one abyss actor card and one abyss actor script from this uh, spell card from the deck to the hand for the rest of the turn. You're locked into abyss actors. Okay. All right, activate Pot of Desires, go Banish. So Banish, draw Fenrir, Talons. They Banish two Theosis there and Arise. Um, so then they're going to go Special Summon out Unicorn, Unicorn Effect. They don't Imperm that. Okay, uh, that's very interesting to not Imperm. Maybe they, th maybe they think that they can just break the board. Uh, Fenrir, grab Scareclaw, catch Tira, make Draco Sack, Draco Sack Effect, attach, chain Imperm. Sure, Scareclaw, Cash Tira, Summon, Banish, Link Off, Make SP Little Guy, Effect, Banish, Scareclaw, Cash Tira, and then Birth, Summon out Fenrir, Activate Pressured Planet, Grab out Cash Tira, Rise Heart, and then Rise Heart Effect, Summon out, Rise Heart Effect, can go Banish, uh, we're gonna go ahead and Banish Theosis, make him Banish 3 face down, oh my gosh, okay, so Theater, Oh, this is the really good card of the deck. So it says you can uh, reveal one Abyss Actor Pendulum Monster and one Abyss Actor Script in the hand. Add one Abyss Actor, uh, one Abyss Script spell from the deck to the hand with a different name than the revealed spell. And then while you control a Pendulum, summon Abyss Actor Pendulum Monster. Any monster effect activated by the opponent becomes destroyed. One set spell trap the opponent controls. Uh, so then that lets you get the crazy effects of these. Um, so this one is Dramatic Story. You can target one Abyss Actor Pendulum Monster. You control Special Summon 1 with a different name from the deck. And then place the targeted monster in your Pendulum Zone or destroy it. Uh, if, this card is, okay, if this card is set and destroyed by an opponent. Um, and you have a face-up Abyss Actor Pendulum Monster in your extra deck. You can return up to two cards on the field to the hand. So this doesn't have the best one. But there's other ones that let you like draw five and stuff like that. Uh, Theosis. Grab the Scareclaw Cash Tira. And then overlay, go into a Shang, set Imperm pass, they draw Valor, standby phase, Shang, special summon out the Fenrir, and then activate the Dress Rehearsal to go ahead and search out Curtain Razor and Dramatic Story. So Curtain Razor actually has another effect besides just summoning itself. It gains 11, and then once per turn, you can send one Abyss Grip spell from the deck to the graveyard, and then add one face of Abyss Actor Pendulum Monster from the extra to the hand. Uh, but on res, they will drop Droll. Yeah, they have to read over it, which is like, you know, fair enough. Uh, activate extra, special summon out. And then they're going to go activate cosmic relief, which is uh, maybe trying to bait the opponent in the imperm. Maybe that's why we used it here. But use the effect, try to take control of Shang. Um, says needs to switch both, right? If one leaves, it doesn't resolve. Yup, so SP, banish, banish. Okay, and then... 
activate curtain raiser to special and then link off in the hyper director so you can target one card in your pendulum zone special summon it then place an abyss actor pendulum monster with a different name from your deck or extra deck to your pendulum zone okay then you're locked into abyss actors for the rest of the turn um, so they're going to go ahead, activate Wild Hope, affect the pop it, which will also allow Wild Hope. Won't work because we're under draw. Okay, yeah, it has to add from the deck. Okay, so effect, try to pop, and then they chain Imperm. Now we're going to go Pendulum Summon out the Curtain Razor. And then activate Dramatic Story. Okay, so Summon, and then pop. We're going to Summon out Superstar. So this card says, when this card is normal, Summon, especially on your opponent's spells and traps, the effects cannot be activated. Once per turn, you can set an Abyss script spell directly from deck, but send it to the graveyard during the end phase. Scale effect, you contribute an Abyss Actor monster, target one script on the graveyard, add to hand. Okay. Uh, oh, then they just submit the feat. Maybe they forgot that Pressured Planet made, uh, made Fenrir have the boost. So now we got Valor, Nib, D Barrier, Sassy, Rookie, Cosmic Relief. They have Nib, Rise Heart, D Barrier, Draw, Pressured Planet. Okay, so Sassy, Rookie. Uh, if an Abyss Actor monster you control be destroyed by battle or opponent's card effect, you can destroy this card instead. The first time this card be destroyed by battle or card effect, each turn it's not. If this card is destroyed by battle or this card in the owner's monster zone is destroyed by an opponent's card effect, you can summon a level 4 or lower Abyss Actor from the deck. Then, if this card is in the Pendulum Zone is destroyed, you can target one level 4 or lower monster the opponent controls and destroy it. Okay. So, Normal Summon, and then Make Hyper, Scale Sassy, Effect, Pop. Uh, does it not pop? Oh, wait, wait, it's Special Summons. Never mind, never mind. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Special. Oh, it's... Okay, I thought it popped for a second. Okay, it's Special Summons it and then Scales. Okay, okay. I guess I was just trying to treat it like Electromite a little bit, I guess. Uh, so this card says, Pay a thousand, go search an Abyss Actor Pendulum Monster from the decks of the hand. Also, you're locked into Abyss Actors for the rest of the turn. Monster Effect gains 100 attack for each Abyss. Script Spell into the Graveyard, okay. And then one a Pendulum Monster. You control just survive battle. You can summon this card from your hand. If an Abyss Grip spell or effect is activated, you can summon one level 4 Abyss Actor Pendulum Monster from your deck, but return it to hand during the end phase. Okay. Okay. So now they're going to go ahead, make Super Producer, uh, two monsters, including a Fiend Monster. And this is the one that they were playing in Unchained for a little bit. Um, so during your main phase, quick effect, you can target one face of card you control, destroy it, then apply one of these effects. Or you can apply one of the following effects. Uh, place the field spell from the deck out, or place one Abyss Actor Pendulum Monster from your deck into your Pendulum Zone. So now, okay, I guess it's, it kind of is cool. Like, if you have, like, any scale plus a body, I guess you can go, like, Hyper, Pop, you can get Mellow, Pay a Thousand, go for Wild, Effect, Pop, Wild... Uh, go ahead, put field spell out, wild effect, go search, scale wa uh, scale whatever you searched off of wild, and then pendulum summon out a couple bodies. It might, it might even be a better way to do that too, but that, that is kind of cool. Uh, so effect, pay a thousand, go search out the wild hope, and then, wait, oh, they didn't drop draw, okay, pendulum out, it said reading, set, pass, wait, what? Huh. What? Nah, that was a misplay. Why didn't we use this? We could have activated the effect. Pop Wild Hope. Go search for Field Spell. Like, put it in the deck face up. Wild Hope effect. Go search. Grab an Abyss Actor card. Okay, so they're going to go main phase. Activate Rock. Chain. Pop Wild Hope. Put out Field Spell. Uh, Nib doesn't resolve, D-Barrier is instead popped. Yeah. Is that why they did it? To play around it? Uh, oh. Oh. Okay. And then New Chain, Wild Hope, go search out Dress Rehearsal. But you can only use it at the start of main phase. Maybe they should have grabbed... Cause it says pop one set. I don't know. I feel like maybe we should have grabbed a body. Like one of the good spells that we can set. So that way this can stop a body. And then you get like a bunch of pluses. 
They draw Fenrir, Pressured Planet, Grab Out Unicorn, then Special Out Unicorn, Effect, go grab out Birth. Oh, it becomes, okay, it does become that, yeah, even though we don't have one, so it actually won't work. Yep, that is how it will work there, okay, yeah. Alright, fair enough, Normal Outrise, Effect, Banish Birth, go Banish 3 face down, Chain Veiler onto that. Okay, I guess just doesn't want it to become level 7. Uh, they're going to go ahead and banish Wild Hope from the extra deck off Unicorn. Uh, then they're going to link into a Donner, Donner effect. Uh, pop itself, plus Cosmic Relief, and then chain Super Producer to go ahead, pop, and then bring out the Wild Hope. Alright, Special Summon out Fenrir, Fenrir effect, go grab out Scareclaw, catch Tira. And then Scareclaw Cash Tira, so they are on summon number 5 now. Uh, so summon that out, main phase, drop the rock. The opponent does have D-Barrier though. And even though they did go second, like that is very strong against the Pendulum deck if you can like, you know, wipe their board and then D-Barrier the follow up. So they draw Ash. Uh, standby phase, D-Barrier, call Pend. Activate Dress Rehearsal. Could have waited until at least this, because this can only be activated at the start of main phase. So we know for a fact they're starting with this and not a Pendulum Summon. So they're going to grab Curtain Razor and Rise of the Abyss King. Okay, and this card's... Uh, I'm pretty sure it's the pop one. Target face of cards on the field up to the number of attack position Abyss Actor Monsters you control with different names. Uh, destroy them. If you control a level 7 or higher Abyss Actor Monster, your opponent can activate anything in response to this. And if this card is destroyed... You know, if the set card is destroyed by an opponent's card effect, while well, you have an Abyss Actor Pendulum Monster in your extra deck, you can add up to two Abyss Actor cards or Abyss Script spells with different names from your deck to the hand. So, now we're going to go Field Spell, Reveal, and then go Search to go grab out a spell. Grab out the Dramatic Story. Okay, is our opponent allergic to draw and Lockbird? Like, a actually, actually... Okay, I was going to say, is it a visual bug and it's not actually draw? I actually had to check there. That is crazy. Are we allergic to activating draw? It won't work because of this. No, because it only says, why you control a pendulum summon to Abyss Actor. Oh, so what we're hoping to... Wait. It won't even work because they can't pendulum summon out. Huh. So we're going to go pop because they also have this that can pay a thousand to go search. Curtain Razor, dump for cost. Yeah, dump the opening ceremony. Yeah, this card says draw until you have five if it's popped. Nice. I know there's one that says, like, summon until you have a full field. Activate, go search out Superstar. And then set a back row. We should definitely have attacked. Definitely should have attacked there, for sure. But Passage, draw Theosis. All right, on to the next game now. We're going to go ahead, and we are going to see Jeremy go first. Opening hands, we got Droll, Evenly, Cosmic Relief, Failure, Sassy Rookie. Hey, the two-card combo again. They got Catch Tira, Rise Hard, D-Barrier, Trap Trick, Unicorn, Ash. No shot they're playing Trap Trick with D-Barrier. And they saw it two games in a row, so they probably side deck three of it. There's no shot. Unicorn Effect. Okay, so we're just trying to drop Droll. Yup. And then... Uh, Unicorn Effect to rip. They forgot to do that. Okay. Summon Rise Effect. Banish Fenrir. Veilers that. That's crazy. That's crazy. Uh, Birth Summon out Fenrir. And then Set D Barrier Pass. They draw Imperm. So we're going to go Battle Phase. Evenly. D Barrier Chain. Call Pendulum. Leave them with just a Fenrir. And then Normal Summon out Sassy Rookie. Activate Cosmic Relief effect okay yeah i'm making go ahead switch control i was trying to think if there's ever a world where we go like link one effect target spawn trap zone so because we can still pendulum one i don't know the scale of the other one there may have been a way for us to pendulum one though and have scales set up so that we actually have follow up. Uh, we know that they play Donner, but I guess they can imperm to stop Donner. They draw a nib. Normal summon out Ash Blossom. Go up into a Donner here. Donner effect, cut out Fenrir, chain imperm, 
and then set trap trick pass. They draw abyss script, abyss tainment, tribute abyss actor monster targeting an abyss script and spell set it. Okay, if it's destroyed, you can special summon as any number of abyss actor pendulum monsters from your deck. Yeah, like imagine your opponent, like you pop a back row and your opponent goes, all right, I'll summon five. Uh, they're going to go attack, effect, banish face down, attack, set, pass. So we're really just hoping that they don't have anything. So they're going to trap trick into an imperm here. Uh, they said, oh, my bad, can't. You sided out the imperms? You have to leave at least two imperm in your deck if, you, if you're siding a trap trick. I feel like that's like standard for trap trick. Oh my gosh, the punish is so real. The punish is so real. Set, pass, draw evenly. Okay. Battle phase, attack, and then sets evenly, pass. Well, I guess we should have never probably set this card, right? Because, like, they're never going to pop our back row. So they shouldn't have set this. They shouldn't have set this. They draw Ash Blossom, pass, draw Rise of the Abyss King. There's no shot that they just don't draw anything here again, right? They draw D-Barrier. Okay, they can set Ash Blossom. Set D-Barrier, pass, draw Superstar. Okay. Battle phase, attack, you know, drawing like an Ash Blossom there would have been game. Could have went normal summon Ash, attack in the Ash, take 18, Fenrir, attack effect, banish face down, try to go for game. Pass, they draw Droll, set pass, we draw extras, extras effect, try to special, they're going to call Pendulum off the barrier We probably should have honestly played around that, because this card gained special summon... Doesn't even matter. We should just yeah, we should just play it around that. Should just went normal summon. And then we could have went for game. Yeah, or at least forced out an imprim if they had it. So I feel like once you see trap trick, like the odds of them having another D barrier in deck is like Hmm, that's something that definitely could be there. Uh pass, they draw ash blossom and they just scoop. Wow. They said lol. There's no shot, there's fifteen watchers. That, okay, hold on. Let me click on Watcher's chat real quick. Yo, what kind of circus stuff is this? Don't disrespect the Abyss actors. Whoa, all right, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. But, ah, uh, okay. Obviously, that was not, like, that was, like, not normal at all. That game was not normal. But, wow, okay, so Abyss actors went, honestly... Scratch everything that happened game one. Scratch everything that happened game three. Game two, I did kind of like seeing what I saw with the Abyss Actors. Sadly, this deck is just not real at all. Uh, their support is not good enough. Uh, their deck is like lacking a bunch. But the thing is, if you give this deck like really good support, um, then like the spells might end up being too broken. Because I mean, they're just naturally built broken, right? Like this card says, summon five from deck. This card says add two cards from deck to hand. The one says draw until you have five. Like some of these cards are just naturally built broken. So like they put these broken effects in this bad archetype for a reason, right? And they've given them some decent support over the years. They got the link one, they got the link two. Like, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's going to take. A link three, they'll let you pendulum summon again. Hey, <laughs> Hey, I don't know, I don't know. Maybe I'm cooking right now. But all right, all right, all right. I guess any pendulum deck could take that and it'd be broken. But all right, with all that being said, the DB Grinder signing off. Peace, have a nice day, stay safe.